me. Uh, yeah, so excited. This is her third haircut and we wanted to show you her new haircut. So the first time she came, we did uh, that first video and then she come and we cut it. And now I'm gonna show you that cut. And so, and, and why I'm cutting it, you can just kind of follow along um, and we're just gonna talk. It's, it's just fun. I want you guys to see, I know in the last video I had said about 800 times how cute Polly is, <laughs> but really her personality is phenomenal. Um, she's definitely gorgeous, but her personality rocks. So anyway, we're just gonna chat and stuff. And um, yeah, she's from Provo. It's about, took him about 50 minutes to get here. And um, she brought her friends, so it's been a fun day. We've just been chatting for the last hour. And can you make me look younger in this video? <laughs> I love it. See, just get, like that. Can you make me look younger in this video? Get rid of those jowls. Can you do some editing? Yeah, like, and are you kidding me, you guys? She's 78. Like, look at this. And she needs editing? No, she does not need editing. <laughs> She's gorgeous. But, you know, we are all hard on ourselves. But, yeah, she is so much fun. And, wait, you was going to tell me a story when... What story was you going to tell me? No? Oh, story? oh, when Linda was here we're talking about the 15 minutes of fame with these videos. <laughs> and I said, well, at least it's better than the one that I had with the white skunk. Oh, right. Okay, so uh, white skunk. Do you want to tell us? Well, I, we had this problem in the yard with, uh, we couldn't figure out, we had this new hose, but every time I went to water the flowers and stuff, it was like a, a sprinkler hose, and we'd think, what is going on here? This is the brand new hose, so we'd go and buy a, another hose, and then the next time we'd go water stuff, uh, it would be like a sprinkler hose again. And we figured out that the man, the chap behind us had has chickens, and we discovered that we had a, um, oh, what do they call those animals with the... Raccoon, yeah. Oh, raccoon. okay, okay. Well, we had a raccoon that was living under the deck. Oh. And mm -hmm. what he was doing, he, he was biting the hose and making it like, um, making it like a, like a sprinkler, sprinkler hose. Oh my gosh. So what he did was he would, the guy, the, you know, the chap behind us had chickens and he would kill the chickens and then bring it onto my deck. No. And, and wash, he, yeah, wash, you know, Raccoons apparently wash the food, you know, and so oh, he was he was using my hose. So anyway, so I thought I'm going to get rid of this guy. So I I, I go down to Springville and I get this trap. Yeah. And um, and they said, okay, what you need to do is get a uh, an egg and put a lot of um, peanut butter around it. Okay. And, and put it in the back of the trap, and the raccoon will go in and eat it. And so, put that out. Well, the next morning I went out, and there was the neighbor's cat. So, oh, a neighbor's cat? Yeah. So, that happened for about the next four mornings. I caught every neighbor different, had cats. Different cats. I caught every neighbor's cat. Oh my cat. gosh, that's funny. And so, finally, well, there was this one morning, I looked out the bedroom window, and I saw, uh, I said, said to my husband, oh, looks like I've gone a white cat this time. So I go out, but as I'm getting closer and closer to the trap, I could smell that it was not my average cat. Oh, <laughs> And no. it turned out to be a, a skunk, but it was white, it was albino skunk. What? Oh my so, gosh. So I, we have this chap in the next street to us that was worked for the newspaper. So I, I, I said, hey, Pat, do you want to come and see this white skunk that I've just trapped? And so he said, yeah. So he came over and he made like a story out of it and took a picture and put it in the paper. Oh my gosh, and I And so love it. I said, oh my gosh, this is my... Oh, anyway, but like there was no picture of me in it. It was just the white skunk. Oh, darn it. So, well, anyway, the next, day, but the next day I got this call from KSL. And they, they came down and said... They had picked up the story? No Yeah, they way. picked up the story. And so <laughs> they talked to me and said, do you, have a, do you have a video of the skunk? And I said, yeah, I do. So they took the video, um, took my camera in. And then they started talking to me. 
They said, we'll come back a bit later on and we'll talk to you about this. On camera, and I saw, I said to my husband, I'm not, I don't want to do that. He said, well, I'm not doing it. And then my daughter, she said, well, I'm out. <laughs> So it was so just you. me. So it was just me and the skunk. Oh my god! And so, Halloween. so anyway, they oh. they did this bit piece. And, so you were really you know, on TV was, talking was, about the white skunk. Yeah. So that you caught by yourself. That, that was oh my, my gosh, that was my it. fifteen minutes of fame that I shared it with a skunk. I love it. That is the best. That's cute. So this one is a little bit better. It's a bit. It's a, we we've upped it a bit. <laughs> oh, I love it. That is the best. Yeah, oh, dear. Anyway. So, okay, but that is crazy. So, like, getting close to it and obviously taking pictures, like, did it, it didn't spray? Like, well, I didn't get that close. Okay. <laughs> oh, I don't blame you. Yeah. Because I'm thinking, like, how would you do that? You know what I mean? Get... Well, the guy that, that was in the next street, this, this my, my neighbor, Pat, he, um, he was the one that was with the newspaper. Oh, okay. So, he kind of let it out of the cage. From a distance, and I videoed it while he was doing that. Oh, so that okay. was the that was the video that KSL used. I see. Got it. Got it. Got it. So that was my. That is too funny. So funny. I love it. My fifteen minutes of fame with the white skunk. The white yeah, it had bright pink eyes, and it was just totally white. Mm -hmm. uh, and that is crazy. Like that. That a skunk, but an albino skunk. Yeah. Like you don't see that. No, you know? no. Well, that's why I called Pat. You know, I said, right. You're like, okay. This is a story here, Pat. Yes. Oh my gosh, I love it. Oh, I bet your husband was proud. Yeah. yeah. I don't know about that. <laughs> <laughs> we could have used a better subject if we had to be on telly for, for a while. <laughs> I love it. That is the best. I love it. I love it. So you guys can see, Pauline, we took the one side off of her hair. Um, and you've liked it, haven't you, Pauline? Oh, yes. Good. I had that other style for a long time, you know, so it was... Right, so you're just ready for a little change. Bit, yeah. and... But well, it wasn't a great deal of a change, but it was just enough to... Right, make see feel that? Like I'd yeah. done something different. <clears throat> and that's what I love. I love that, because you can change it up, but you don't have to... Do something because sometimes you know with people and shorter hair, they just want a little bit of a change. They want it short. They want it easy. But yeah, so a little change like this is always nice. And of course, her sides. We're just making these nice and piecey. Okay, now we'll come to this side and trim that so it's. It's just her birthday too, a few weeks ago, so happy late birthday. <laughs> Have fun. Yeah, she had a way fun day too. I loved it. What did you do? Um, where my, my, one of my sons and her and his wife took me for breakfast. Oh, lovely. And he took me to this rare book place. Oh, it has all kinds of rare books and. Do you love books? I, I yeah, and I love history. History, mm -hmm. you know, me too. So I'm a big history. Guy. To be able to see a Bible that belonged to Henry VIII, I mean that it was his That's personal cool. Bible. Wow, isn't that yeah. cool? And Joseph Smith's baby shoes. Oh, yeah, neat. Yeah, mm -hmm. and then you know, and I held the first edition of Book of Mormon that was, and it was. You know, and it says all the witnesses in the back. Right. Um, well, it, it in the first edition, the witnesses are in the back, and the ones that we have now are in the front, but right. they're in the back. Wow. And so cool. Samuel Smith was one of the witnesses, and he had written beside his name, this is me, in his own writing. Like, oh. this is me, I'm Samuel, this is this my This is name. my, this is my <laughs> oh, It was gosh, kind of like I he was it. witnessing the witness. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> Gonna have to come and restyle it over here. No. <laughs> and there, he had a, um, a a King James Bible. The first King James Bible of that belonged to King James. Oh my goodness! I mean, those kind of things are just 
that that right. Kind of that's incredible. That right. kind of thing is incredible to me. That's I love like English history too. Like that's mm. I just yeah. I could dive into hours and hours of you know well, of that. Royal Next time we're in Provo, you ought to go there. It yeah. sounds like really I that is really, really cool. cool. Just, just walk in there. Just for what you just walk in. Really? Yeah. 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 Incredible. Absolutely incredible. That's cool. I had the best. I just had the best time there. That's so nice. And it's not and to be with them. Easy. That's really neat. Oh, I didn't pay. And then I'm just gonna trim. Like I said, we always love this, right? <laughs> Do you love this pulling this part? Oh, yeah. I know. I'm just clean. yes. In fact, the other day I had my daughter come out and I'm like, hey, hurry and just clean up my neck a little bit. Texture, Pauline, and you'll be set. Be smashing. Smashing. See, you guys. <laughs> Are you kidding me? That is, one, that is one of the things. Um, last time after her video, when we stopped it, we was just talking stuff, and she's like, oh, it's just smashing. It's smashing. <laughs> and I'm like, oh, my gosh. Your words are so stinking cute. Oh, I love it. It's fun. Fun, fun. The root lifter. How are you liking your products, Pauline? I like them. Oh, good. A lot. Good, good. Are you amazed how long they last? <laughs> mm -hmm. Okay. I like that paste a lot. You know, the oh, paste yeah, the clay, clay, yes. Clay, yeah. Yeah, because it doesn't make it sticky, huh? But it no, really no, it holds it. it. <laughs> it's smashing. <laughs> but she says it way better than I do. It's just something with your... Your accent, I love it. She didn't know she was being videotaped today, so it was so nice of her to let us. We just said, we really should show off how fun you are and how your new haircut is. And anyway, and so she said, okay, well, sounds good to me. So that was sweet of her. She looked good, and then you get a cut, and it's crazy how it can just change, yeah. like right off. You know what I mean? It's it's nuts, especially when you're the one styling it, right? <laughs> it makes it much easier when it's cut. Well, you work your magic, and then you see it. <laughs> <laughs> you're sweet. Thank you, thank you. Okay, so this is the clay she was talking about. I'm going to turn her into the mirror for a second, just so I can see. Unless you are the fairest of them all. Do it. <laughs> Look at this. Yeah, see, that's, that's so nice. I, that I love mirror. you. <gasps> that is so cute. I have that on my mirror, though. Do, uh, uh, I, I like that. You do? I got it written there, just to remind me. That's 
adorable. I love that. <laughs> love it, love it. Yes, I Thank you. What's that? Just in case you forgot. Yeah. yeah, just in case. That's right. It's a good reminder. It's a good reminder. Absolutely. I think we all need to say that to ourselves when we look in the mirror. Yep. Because it's the truth. Absolutely. Not except for the jealous part. <laughs> Yeah, she's talking about her job. I'm like, what? What are you talking about? I want to, next time we video, I want to put some, something back there. That makes <laughs> the tape stuff, just yeah, okay. band-aids or something. <laughs> band-aids. Donna, can you grab me a couple band-aids, please? Oh, just don't, don't turn her to the back. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> okay, how does it look? Smash in. Smash in. Smash in. I love it. Hey, Pauline, thank you so much, and thanks for bringing your friends. I adore you. You are the best. So, thank you. Anyway, I love, love the skunk story. That was the best. So, you guys have a good day. Thanks again for your support, and go ahead and jump on the email list for free drawings and fun tips. So, have a good day. See ya. Cheerio.